Hello, Gemini. Happy Friday to you. Happy weekend to you guys. This is Monica with Pisces Moon Intuitive. Gemini, I hope you're doing great. We're going to do your uh, soulmate reading. You want to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, as usual, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, what you'll be dealing with, facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. The universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Gemini. For Gemini's highest good, please. The universe, please show us what's coming up for Gemini in their life and how is Gemini currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Gemini in their life? And how is Gemini currently doing on their soulmate journey? <clears throat> this one wants to show up as extra message. Hmm. So there was a disagreement, serious disagreement between you and your soulmate. You felt you feel let down by them. You're not reaching out to them. You're not communicating with them at this time. You're still holding on to that relationship <clears throat> in some capacity, but you feel uh, betrayed in this relationship for some reason. You feel let down. Yeah, you're kind of surprised that things escalated like they did. The... There was a serious disagreement because here you see five swords together. Yeah, you're not sure how to handle this situation right now. You're just staying put. You're not reaching out. You still care for this person emotionally. You still love them, but you're not reaching out to them. At times you feel that maybe they don't care about you emotionally like you thought they did. Universe, please show us. <clears throat> This is a heavy reading already. The tower is showing up. This is you kind of surprised, kind of taking a step back <clears throat> to look at this situation more objectively, to try to understand their point of view. <clears throat> yeah, you, you're wondering if they're going to reach out to you. You feel that you've done everything in your power to make this relationship work. Yeah, ooh, so here is Five of Swords again. Here's Seven of Swords, Five of Swords clamped together over here. And here's Five of Swords. You feel let down in this relationship. You feel heartbroken. You feel sad, and you're not reaching out. The sword for communication is pointing down. You're not reaching out to this person at this time. Yeah, you feel that uh, you stood your ground, and you said what you needed to say to be fair to yourself. You feel overstressed about this situation. This is you holding on to a lot of stress from this situation. You're not reaching out to this person. You are trying to use your intuition to figure out what it is they thinking, feeling, planning. You are very intuitive. Yeah. It's like you're trying to check up on them to see if they're planning to reach out to you. You guys are so connected emotionally, spiritually. You're going to be celebrating some kind of accomplishment that has to do with finances, job, business. You see this? Investments, perhaps, for some of you. You're going to be celebrating some kind of... Uh, positive situation going on at your job yeah you're very good at your job yeah you see a lot of people admire you look up to you respect you beautiful right now you worried about this situation with the soulmate let me see what's going on here wow you're so resilient you're so strong gemini you know what we show us What's going on currently with Gemini and how is Gemini currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Gemini? You worried a lot. 
yeah this is you not showing it on the outside but you worry a lot this is you uh, having a lot of worries about different things in your life you're very guarded emotionally so you do feel a great need to clear the air with that soulmate of yours but you're worried you're scared of reaching out look at all those swords 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 this is you worrying too much, overanalyzing excessively, worrying, which is normal, right? When you're going through something intense emotionally, we worry a lot. All of us do, right? You really want to reconcile with them, though, but you feel so hurt. You feel like they need to make amends with you. Extend the olive branch to you. You would be willing to reconcile with this person if they would prove themselves to you. Um... Yeah, you really love this person still. Let me see what's going on with your soulmate. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with that soulmate of Gemini. And how is that soulmate of Gemini towards Gemini at this time? Especially emotionally. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Gemini? They can be very much set in the ways. It's like they want to reach out, but they're stopping themselves. Yeah, they feel that if they reach out, maybe you're going to say no to them. they worried about that. Wow, they love you a lot. Look at this. This person loves you a lot. So no matter what happened, what was said, this person still loves you a lot. And they recognize that. Oh, but huh, they're trying to disconnect emotionally. Look at this king of swords with the sword pointing down. This person is trying to disconnect emotionally and they can't. They recognize they still love you. Yeah, this person is in love with you, but they're trying to disconnect emotionally. Because this is showing up <clears throat> in their subconscious position when it really should show up here. Instead, they're showing up here after you as king of swords they think maybe you don't want them anymore so they feel they need to shut down their feelings but they can't they tried and they still love you they just don't show it on the outside universe please show us <clears throat> their ego is hurt because of what happened what transpired what was said they feel so hurt <clears throat> universe please show us What's going on currently with that soulmate of Gemini? <coughs> yeah, they're trying to be patient to see how they're going to feel down the road, if, it's, if they're still going to feel the same way. Yeah, this is them feeling a lot of confusion, not knowing what to do right now. And the reason why they worried is because they still love you. They can't just so easily move on. Yeah, you see, they're so sad about what transpired. They regret it. You see, this is them feeling guilt, regret, heartbreak, sadness. Yeah, this person truly cares for you deeply. They regret whatever happened. Ooh, you, you, you showing up here as Queen of Swords with your sword raised up. This person is so worried that if they try to make amends with you, you're going to say no to them you're going to reject them you're going to judge them but honestly for them to find out uh, they would have to reach out to you take that chance look at this the two of you showed up as uh, queen of cups king of cups and queen of swords king of swords so both of your feelings are hurt there's a lot that the two of you need to discuss calmly of course in a calm manner right without arguing right so this was something serious this was a serious situation that transpired between you two and they are concerned about the results this also means apologies peace offerings explanations so this person feels that apologies will need to be spoken in this situation between you two look how worried they are extremely worried and the reason why they worried is because they genuinely still love you Look how scared they are. Scared of your rejection, judgment, feeling 
like maybe they're going to make the right, wrong decision. They're so worried of um, about making wrong decision and doing something uh, or saying something that you might not like. They're trying to be strong, not to feel heartbroken, not to feel scared. You see this? This is them trying to muster the courage. They worry they're going to reject them. They're not sure how you're going to react. They have a lot of worries. You see this? Wow. This person loves you a lot, Gemini. They really do. I hope that two of you work this out. Universe, please show us. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Gemini that Gemini has been dealing with? Look, they're trying to not feel these emotions, this love, these feelings. They're trying to kind of disconnect emotionally. Oh, so it looks like uh, you two in this relationship have broken up before. You broke up, got back together, broke up, got back together. But this was a serious uh, disagreement this time. Very serious. Oh, who's this? Oh, so this person is very worried. And the reason why they worry is because they love you still, that you're going to be with someone else. You see this? They have all these scenarios playing in their mind um, because they view you as attractive, independent, alluring. You see this? Uh, they worry you're going to be with somebody else, but your back is turned towards this energy, which means you're not really looking for a new soulmate, okay? But there's somebody new popping up here as King of Pentacles, which happens to be my favorite King of All Kings. We're going to go into your extended reading, Gemini. Obviously, we're going to ask about this soulmate, but also new soulmate popping up uh, that showed up. Ask King of Pentacles energy. First, however, we're going to ask about this soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you. What they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, whether purposely or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmate entering your life, the King of Pentacles energy, new chapters, new beginnings in your life. Also health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Gemini, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.